And today I'm here with my Boxing Day book outlet sale haul. I finally went and picked up the books, so I figured I should haul them for you guys and let you know what I bought this sale. So without further ado, let us get started. The first book that I bought is called The Chaos of Standing Still by Jessica Brody. And I bought this solely because it was on so many people's like best of 2018 lists. A lot of people said that they weren't expecting it to be as good as it was. So I want to see if I think the same thing and if I can jump on the bandwagon your girl loves herself some bandwagons so we're gonna hopefully hop onto it I don't know much about it other than it follows a girl named Rin who has a text message on her phone that's been there for over a year because her best friend died and it was like the last thing that she sent to her and she doesn't want to read the text and then she is at an airport and there's like a flight delay and she runs into a guy named Xander and they end up switching phones by accident and then shit goes down. It's a contemporary so it'll be a nice uh, break from my murder murder stabby stabby books that I usually read. The next book I got was because I have the second book in the series so you know you need the first book in the series. So I thought what better time to buy the books that I actually need to complete series and stuff than Boxing Day because we love ourselves a sale but it is The Crown's Game by Evelyn Skye. I have the second book already so we needed the first one because you can't read the second book before you read the first book. Duh. The next book I have is a sequel to a book that I absolutely loved when I read it so I needed the sequel obviously but it's Perfect by Cecilia Ahern and this is the second book to Flawed. I read Flawed back in 2016 maybe 2017? Don't know which it was, but I remember I gave it like a 4 or a 4.5 out of 5, so I clearly liked it very much, so now I have the second one and I can find out what happens next in the story. The next book I have is the second book in like a companion series. I just got the like arc of the fourth book in the series. It might be the third, not 100% sure, but it is Wish Granter by CJ Redwine. This is the companion novel to The Shadow Queen. Don't know what the third one is. And then the fourth one, the arc that I have, is a retelling of Cinderella. So I'm going to read this one, then hopefully find the third one in the series so that I can read the arc. Except they're companion novels, so I feel like I don't have to, but I want to because I like fairy tale retellings. So I know this one is a retelling of Rumpelstiltskin, I believe. I've never read one of those, so I'm excited. The next book that I have is the second in the series. I have the third one. Now I have the second one. Now I just have to get the first one. But it is A Torch Against the Night by Saba Tahir. I don't own An Ember in the Ashes. I own the third book and haven't found a copy of the first book. But I want to have it in this cover so that it matches, you know? But it's like so much money and I'm cheap so I'm waiting till I find it on sale because again cheap. The next book I got solely because I needed one more book for the deal of like get $10 off if you spend $35 so picked a book that was 79 cents and it's The Remedy by Suzanne Young. Okay See, this is where I'm confused, if you guys can like clear this up for me. The website said that it was book 0 0.5, but then it also had the exact same book saying that it was the third book. In the series, it's the program series. So is it 0 0.5 or is it 3? Please let me know. And then the final book that I picked up is the third in a series that I have the first two in, so I needed to complete it. But it is The Beauty of Darkness. This is the third book in The Remnant Chronicles by Mary E. Pearson. Again, I had the first two needed the third one. Now I can binge read it. I've heard a lot of good things about this trilogy so I'm very excited about it. Alright guys, so that was my book haul for this time around. Let me know down below if you guys have read any of these and what you've thought of them and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye!